how do you see the investors' interest shaping under the current geopolitical and economic uh, landscape? I, I think that uh, these risks that we see uh, are going to dissipate, hopefully sooner rather than later. Uh, and I think that it's important that uh, money is invested somewhere. And uh, Greece currently is ready with a program for development across many different areas, one uh, of which is uh, the whole energy transition and green transition. Uh, and I think that's why there are going to be a lot of opportunities, both short term and long term, because both because and despite the crisis that we're seeing here because of the Ukraine war, uh, this is going to create opportunities for investments in that area. Uh, how do you see the investors' interest on your specific sector? Water and energy are actually intertwined. Um, so I represent the water sector. And um, the interesting thing, especially with my company, is that we just signed a 20-year agreement uh, with the Greek state that gives a lot of visibility for what we're going to do. And additionally, uh, within this year, there's going to be a new independent regulator in Greece for the water utilities, uh, who is going to be merged into the energy regulator, which means that they are going to pick up speed uh, instantly. Uh, so you have 20 years um, of a future uh, with a new and the with the new regulations, but operated under an established regulator. So that, that will give us the opportunity uh, to move forward with our more than 1 billion euro investment plan uh, and uh, hopefully provide returns for our investors. Uh, according to your opinion, what has to be done to keep the optimistic environment for possible investors in Greece? The optimistic environment for? For possible investors in yes. Greece. Look, uh, in, in the end, it's the results that count. So uh, we need to continue with our work. We need uh, to show how we can, uh, how resilient we are despite whatever crisis, um, and uh, show the opportunities uh, that are in front of us in the future, and how we diligently look at all the factors uh, that enable us to, to shape uh, that future.